Hey YouTube, over here we have my very first fish tank. It is a saltwater reef tank, 16 gallon bow front nano reef. Um, figured I'd make a little video, give back to the community. I know you guys have helped me out a lot with some of your videos and um, some of the information out there on the internet. Um, just got my first four corals in there a couple weeks ago. Everybody's doing pretty well so far. Got some, uh, some candy canes over here. Doing very well. Also got some uh, some polyps over here. Not quite sure what exactly these are. So if anybody knows, please let me know. They look uh, they look great in the blue light. Some uh, Duncan polyps over here. They're doing very well. And uh, some frog spawn right here. It's doing well. That guy was getting knocked over a lot by the residents at first, but. Seems to be doing pretty well right now. Found a good spot for it. Let's see over here. Uh, red fire shrimp right here, blood red fire shrimp. He's really cool, but he uh, does tend to get into some tiffs with uh, this guy over here. It's a coral banded shrimp. I put the coral banded shrimp in there initially to help out with some bristle worm. He did a great job, but he really doesn't get along well with some of his tank mates and uh, haven't been able to catch him. So got some cool snails, some West Indian turbo snails over here. One there, one up there, some other turbo snails, some Ceres snails. And uh, just a little clownfish up here. He likes to hang out in the corners in the tight spaces a lot. I'm not sure if it's because I have too much flow. I calculated around 800 gallons an hour. Uh, it's about a 550 gallon or an hour Corolla right there. This guy, I believe, is 120 gallons an hour. Uh, it's the Fluval 106 output right there. It's about 145 gallons an hour. The intake to it. And, uh, the protein skimmer over here. I'm not sure what the flow rate is on that. I think I read in a forum somebody thought it was around 50. Depending on what the knob set at. Um, but the protein skimmer, uh, it's an Aqua Life 115, something like that. Works great. A lot of micro bubbles the first week, but um, after that, worked awesome. Uh, got this, this heater over here, not sure the brand name. It did run lean the first two days, uh, making the tank a little too hot. Wasn't quite accurate with the settings. And uh, the damsel fish I had cycling did jump out, and this little lady over here got a hold of him. Down here, we've got the uh, 106 canister filter. Works great, very pleased with the performance. Tank is very clean, I'm using uh, distilled water right now and just mixing it with reef crystals. Just uh, supermarket water, water looks very good. And I've got the, uh, the JBJ unibody over here. I originally had the Marineland Reef Capable uh, white LED. This is an LED as well, by the way. And um, wasn't pleased with it at all. It was very difficult to work in the tank. You had to take it off to work in the tank. Um, I also got some water in it, and within a couple weeks it was destroyed. Had to return it. So I got this guy. Works awesome. I uh, really like this little control unit over here I've got it on my desk. It's cool. I can just can adjust the whites. This is uh, 20,000 K of blue right here, 20,000 Kelvin. Good. Yeah. Nah. This guy up. That's about six thousand Kelvin white light. And uh, yeah. That's it, so leave your comments, let me know what you think, if you have any questions, I'll try and answer them the best I can.